All right, guys, we're at O'Toole's campground. After an epic day today, down Sullivan's track. If you really want something that's uh, eye-opening and quite dangerous, uh, yeah, give that one a shot. So, we're at camp at the moment. We're all set up. I put up one awning wall tonight. Just to give me a bit more protection, a bit more space in there. It was quite cold. And it's probably going to start raining, so... This is a 230 Falcon 270 awning. And, uh, yeah, does a great job. Keeps everything nice and dry inside. There's the cruiser. Um, yeah, really interesting day today, as you can see. Done three river crossings. I haven't filmed any of it because we were just uh, in a pinch for time. But she gets used, as you can see. So I'll take you in here. So, got a swag set up in the back. Up here, my chair, and cooking area. All under cover, out of the rain. It's just a bit open over here, but you know, not much I can do about that. Oh well, yeah, there we go. And I'm still waiting for my uh, steaks to defrost. Which they're getting there now, finally. So, steak for dinner. And uh, yeah, should be good. Over here, finally got a fire going. We've got the little uh, birds playing. So, how was that Sullivan's track today? <laughs> <laughs> Adrenaline building. Yeah, <laughs> pretty full on. Heart in mouth. That's it, yeah, it was like that. Good stuff. So, yeah, fire going, found some wood, scrounged it from all the other campsites. Warm and uh, the from me heart. That's it. <laughs> and yeah, that's it at the moment. So, um, yeah, if anything more to report, I'll, uh, I'll check back in. Welcome to O'Toole's campground. So, gone by what I read on the sign, on the other side of the park here, this was a uh, 200 hectares block of land that was leased back in the 1800s sometime. And what happened there was the original owner passed away, someone else took over the lease. And uh, yeah, the rest is really much history. Um, it was reduced down to 89 hectares and then in the early 90s a group of people wanted to reclaim the area it had been overgrown by like um, brambles and all sorts of other bushes and that type of thing so they did that and what you see here today is a tools campground um, yeah very cool this is up Walhalla Road from Walhalla and uh, yeah, really interesting. So down here, there's a little bit of a uh, creek. I'm not going down, it's too muddy. And very wet here, we had a storm come through. Almost lost my awning. It's been great. But yeah, as you can see, it's pretty slippery. Though. I'm not climbing down. Yeah, bit of a running creek system through here on this side. Quite nice. Wouldn't go swimming in it. Just see the uh, current. Yeah. Campground over here. So over this side is Driven Media. I met him, he rolled in a couple of days ago. And he's got a pretty wild uh, D22 nav. Twin locked on 35s. And yeah, this is the campground. Pete reckons there's about 29 fire pits here or something. So, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve in the background there. So, very well likely is about 29, 13, 
I would say that. There's a few over the back as well. And, uh, yeah, pretty nice. Can get pretty sloppy in the wet. If you're looking for somewhere to camp, it's uh, pretty well secluded. No phone reception. Um, yeah, you get these type of fire pits here. So, if you've got a grill, you can cook on the grill. A little wood duck or something over here, carrying on. Um, yeah, that is the campsite. Didn't feel much because it was just way too wet. So, now if you have any questions about it, I'll put links below anyway for all these campsites that I go to. All right, we're packed up at O'Toole's. I've just moved to take some photos of the 80 series. And uh, yeah, we're gonna head on out of here, taking Donnelly Creek Road up to Walhalla. And then we're heading to Woods Point. And the 80 series is doing really well. I've got the small antenna on here just so we can hear people coming around the corners a bit better. There's the uh, long antenna, it's just for mainly line of sight uh, and long range distance that way. Where this is more of a, a uh, circle in the uh, transmission pattern. So uh, yeah, that's where we're at at the moment. And yeah, we'll uh, I'll lock it into four high and uh, we'll uh, get going. Well, head on the Walhalla track, which is pretty treacherous. And uh, we've seen snow. I have snow, I'll touch snow. Six of boats. I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll touch it, I'll pick it up. It is snow. I can say I'll say I've seen snow. So, I've seen snow finally, <laughs> after three years. <laughs> so. <laughs> Ah, pretty cold up here though. Yeah, I hope we'll so, make one some more. Yeah. So we'll see how we go. Just in case we don't, yep. this may be it. Well, that's it, yeah. yeah. So, there we go. Bit of snow. That's a perfect place to pull up. I mean, yeah. Then obviously back down the road here too. Up there. There we go. All right. Okay. Guess we'll keep going.